Miami calls the Orange Bowl our house, and it is very difficult to beat the Canes in their house. They are unbeaten here this year. Oh, Doug Flutie did it a few years ago, but it took a miracle to get the job done. That's how tough Miami is at home. Ken Hatfield and the Razorbacks of Arkansas ready to pour onto the field, and here they come. has it up on the tee again. And we're underway. Foster at the nine, bobbles it at the 10, and he will be short of the 20-yard line in their opening series. Bland down the line on the option, brings the wingman around in new daylight. Jackson was crushed by Bubba McDowell, who came up from the corner for run support. 28 touchdown passes on the season. And he'll throw it on first down. Dropping off the screen to Cleveland Gary. Fumble. And Arkansas believes that they have pounced on it, but perhaps they called him down. They did. We'll check it a second time, but at first glance, that looked like a bad call. They run Gary, trying to cut back. The Arkansas defense swarming is on the wing. Walsh again to throw. Drops it off underneath to Conley for the first down. He's at the 30-yard line. Chudzinski is a tight end. Walsh to Andre Brown, who cuts inside and picks up another five yards with that move before Patrick Williams brings it. just to Coach Mel Scanlon and the team tonight. Third down and long, throwing to Gary. Great defense by Williams, number 24, who is having a spectacular season for the win. season. Good kick. Miami leads it. You need to be in third and two in this kind of offense. Here's Bland off a play fake under pressure, deflected, hit a helmet incomplete. Walsh calling the play at the line. Has time, deflected and caught by one of his linemen. And he gets close to a first down. Bobby Garcia, number 50. And so far, the production has been eight pass and four runs. This is a pass play on third and 10 again. Good pressure on Walsh. He steps up away from it, and Hill drops the ball at midfield. Would have kept the drive alive, but Randall Hill. Roy Aikman, he might have a shot at him. Now Bland turns it around but he's not going to get the first down as Greg Mark forces him out of bounds on that far side. He hammers it. Good! It bounced over! Unbelievable! 23 in a row. Let's see what he comes up with here. He carries the fullback and Conley the tail off a of fake. He moves the pocket to the left. And throws back complete to Chudzinski. For a first down out to the 37-yard line. So it'll be a different kind of a look they'll give the Hurricane defense when he comes on. Oh, what a great catch by Gary. Stopped short of that first down, though. That was Atwater, who was 6'4", 200. Back to return is Horton. And on the fake, the first down. Maurice Crum, the linebacker. Runs for the first out. And somebody probably yelled down there in the middle of a bad snap. Now they bring Andre Brown on a fake. And Walsh goes for the bundle. Complete. And he goes down to the one foot line. He hit Dale Dawkins. First and goal. Barry for the six. So, and Quinn Groby 
into the game at quarterback for his first series. And they run the fullback, Foster, and he goes the distance. Barry Foster for the touchdown. They won't catch him. There are no penalty flags now. And what makes that such a nice play is the Miami defense sees Quinn Grovey come. His eighth score. And the best field goal kicker in college football this year. Adds the X win. He was tough enough. Nine of 14. First pass and he hits a wide man. Near midfield. Straight back. Complete to the 35-yard line. Kroll, the receiver, and it was Bobby Garcia catching that deflected pass. Walsh over the middle, and he's got Highsmith inside the 10 to the 5-yard line. Ah. Gary, and he was stopped short of the goal line by Shepard. The Miami Miami are tied at 10. This has been the 11-play drive, and here it is, fourth and goal for the Canes. They are stuffed. Conley is down as Lloyd was the first to hit him, and Arkansas takes over on downs. What a sensational goal line stand. And I am shocked by... Grovey runs the option coming down the line. He's back in the end zone. Tackle for the safety. Bill Huckins nailed him for the safety. Arkansas must kick it away with the free kick. And this is Hill at the 22. 30, 35, 40, 45. To the 48-yard line. Bubba Barrow bringing him down. X Walsh. He'll throw it on second and ten. It's Dawkins underneath to the Arkansas 45. And Walsh will throw for it, and he's got it. Hits his wide man, and that's plague Miami. This year has been turnovers. Seven times they turned it over against the Irish, and four times against Michigan. There's the fumble, and Arkansas scoops it up. Good call, Brent. I think he heard you, but I thought the pitch... Line Grovey. He brings it down the line on the option, keeps it for the first down, crosses midfield, and he is out of bounds with... Grovey again running the option. Late pitch. Ball is loose. Miami going for it at the 30-yard line, and Arkansas trying to regain control. pitch a moment ago that time Quinn Grovey looked like it was a late and a high pitch so with five minutes to go here in the first half tight end but they've already used a couple of timeouts Walsh comes underneath to Conley who has the first down and near midfield is down at the 48 yard line. Kerry Owen, 10 for Walsh. Quick flip to Conley. Breaks a tackle, fumbles the ball. Arkansas recovers. At the 41, Richard Brothers jumps on the ball. Richard Brothers. Grovey, back in the wishbone. Bringing it down the line, looking for a receiver, and now he'll go to his halfback coming in behind him, Aaron Jackson. In the end zone for the safety, and the Canes are up by two. Foster short of the first down. Fourth down at the 317 mark. Walsh back again, has plenty of time this time, and it is complete near midfield for the first down. Emotion's such a big part of college football. 
Walsh back, sips it complete to Gary, who turns, gets inside midfield, and bolts to the 44, and penalty markers all starts to run again. Walsh will take a shot. Deflected, incomplete. Now it stops at seven, and they'll need worth it. That's on its way. Carlos Huerta puts the Canes up by five. Splendid walk-on kicker. it will be great. You can see this great defensive team of Arkansas and their running attack from quarterback. It's going to be a great matchup between that and Aikman and, and the throwing arm uh, from UCLA. Thanks, Jimmy Brent. Still clean and untarnished so far. And it's nice to see them being rewarded by going to the Cotton Bowl. Walsh throws it underneath to Conley here. And now Conley breaks free, and he's got a first down to 35. And the Canes on the move. Walsh off a quick drop, throwing far side, complete to Hill. He stepped out of challenge by this offense. Third and short. Walsh throws for the first down. Conley fumbles the ball. Ark, no, it's being called in. Here's Cleveland Gary, and they swarm all over him. Boy, did they hold the fort again. Reggie Hall gets in there on the hip. Coming down the line, he keeps it off the fake and bolts free. Groby across midfield. Bobby Harden finally brings him down, but 80 yards on one play for a touchdown. They show blitz, and they hand off and pound right into that position. Getting to the 39-yard line with Barry Ho. And Groby throws for it, and he's wide open. 15, 10, first down for Arkansas. They throw the ball to Barry. Groby pulls back under pressure. Can't spot an open receiver. Throws back, wide open, touchdown, Arkansas. Number 18, Barry Foster scores again. He should go for two to try to make it a three-point ball game. And Groby being chased. Turns around on the run. He'll have to throw this 40 yards into the end zone. There's a penalty marker down. Penalty marker down. It is no good. He's 31. Quick, run to the roulette wheel in Las Vegas. Walsh hands it off. Here's Garrett. He's out to the 32-yard line. 17-point underdog, leading by a point. And Walsh has got Dawkins. He bobbled the ball, and let's see. Right, they're going to spot it. Walsh again throwing on first down pressure and runs away from it. Slides down and is hit there at the 40, 47 for a first down. Walsh with time and he's got it to Chudzinski. First down Miami. Walsh under pressure to Gary short of a first down. Hit quick baseball so far for Ron Frazier. Walsh on a quick throw on it, Gary, and overthrew him that time. And it'll be fourth down, third down, and seven now for Arkansas. And Groby running out on the draw. It was sealed up. Breaks one tackle, and then Crum buries it. They were diving for it that time. He just barely got it off. It rolls dead at the 40. Only 23 yards. Walsh throws short of the first down. In with the Chudzinski. Bad snap. Where the picks it up and he's down. Arkansas takes over. The break the Razorbacks have been looking for. I'm not so sure it was as much a bad snap as it went right through Kalal's hands. The backs must win this game. Second down and 10 now. 
45 to go. Groby, options, Hawkins, all over Aaron Jackson. You know, Just to give Trainer an opportunity, but they need 17 yards for a first down. Under pressure, steps away from it, and he is down at the 39-yard line. Jimmy Jones bringing the five yards away from a touchdown on 8.45 and the wind at their back. Walsh again. Far side and has Andre Brown another first down, depending on where they spot the ball. Second and short. He wants the first down. And Gary breaks free and pounds to the Arkansas 47 scoreboard here this afternoon. Gave up an 80-yard touchdown. Walsh to throw again on first down. Wide open, Chet Zetsky. The tight end is hurting Arkansas right now. He's inside the 30. Harper. Conley to the 19. And a defense that has been on. They'll try to get Conley free inside the 15. And he is out of bounds with Harper tackling him. That backfield as a receiver. Walsh. Goes to the far corner, knocked down and incomplete. Terrific coverage by Atwater, and he almost intercepted the ball in that corner. He came so... Palau handles this one. And Huerta puts Miami back into the lead. And it now, first and ten for Arkansas. Three minutes to go. Bland straight back. And he's hit. Ball is knocked free. Jimmy Jones crushed him. Should have been intercepted by Farms. There is a penalty marker down. Penalty marker. You see the safety man there on the right-hand side in case anything happens. It's called the Joe Pizarchik defense. <laughs> Miami was in a tussle today. saw youngsters can go home with their heads high. Miami didn't win this game. They survived it. Not at all like the thumping that Johnson gave his alma mater a year ago. 